Hi, my name is Kayla Oniwo. I am a media personality with Cool FM, fashionista, and all that cool stuff. Now, I am the special guest on Budget Chef, and today I'm supposed to make a meal with 400 naira. So, I think that's crazy. I, I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but you guys have to watch out. I am making a spaghetti egg sauce with 400 naira. See how it's just two shots, they're 400. Yes, yeah, so let's see how that works. So I'm off to the market, come with me. Hi! So I'm at the mini stand. Uh, I want to buy things that I need to make my meal. Okay, so I want to buy tomato, small onions, and small pepper. Strong one for me. Fresh one. Mm -hmm. Small, wait, you know what it's going to do? Small tomato, small onion, small pepper. Like, like 200 naira. Yeah. You go feed one, you go feed one. Put onion. So I'm making the spaghetti sauce, all right? I already have spaghetti at home. I already have some eggs at home, so I know I'm cheating, but this is exactly what I need. So I have to buy exactly what I need. So I'm getting pepper, tomatoes, and onion. Thank you. So, that's enough to make my meal. Wow, I've got some change. Okay. All right, so let's go cook, guys. Let's go cook. Come, come, come. So I'm back from the market. Um, yes, I went there to buy um, everything that I needed under the budget. Okay, so I, I, I did a pretty good job. Okay, so I got tomatoes, onion, uh, tomatoes, onion, pepper, around money. Uh, I already had spaghetti at home because I like to shop in bulk. So I had I already had my spaghetti. I also had my eggs already. <laughs> I'm not going to buy another one. So I already had it. So I have my spices and everything that I need to cook this particular meal. So let's get started. I need to wash them. I'll pick out the stubs. Because I'm gonna dice them. I, this is the part that I hate the most. I'm gonna let that run in the water a little bit. Get my onions ready. These guys have been through so many things, so we need to wash them very well. So, I love onions. It might be a little bit too much for some people, but I, I use like a really, really large amount of onion when I'm cooking. Food, food means joy. <laughs> See, there's, even if I'm broke, and I see food like this, wow. You know, I'm always happy. Like, I mean, without food, I think we can't survive. We can't live. So I was at a restaurant yesterday and, you know, I was dull. Immediately the platter came. Come and see the way my mouth is running. That's how I love food. I hear that the secret to cutting onions and not getting, um, people have said too many things. There are many myths, like um, chew, you need to chew some gum or, I don't know, the way my mom taught me, <laughs> there's nothing like that, just go ahead with the flow. So if I start crying here, cry with me. So I'm just gonna cut this like really small. You know like when you're watching these chef shows on TV, you see them doing cha 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 nah. See the process is not really important, it's how it gets into your tummy and how it tastes at the end. Well, except it's like Buka food Sha, where you don't know where the water is coming from and all that stuff. But this is how I like to cut my onion. Some people like to cut it round, but I like mine to just be cut like in small pieces. I can't believe it, I've never gone to the market with 400 naira in my life. Guys, never. For waiting. So now I even know it's kind of made me realize that, eh. Shout outs to my, my, um, my assistant at home, Bola. From today, you're going to the market with 400 naira. All this, so madam, the money is 22,500. That one has stopped to 400 naira alone. So yeah, I'm almost done cutting my onion. Um, you're gonna see something crazy that I'm gonna do. Because I, I don't like my spaghetti too soft, so, and it doesn't take a long time to cook. 
um, and I always like it, you know, ready to go. So that's why I haven't started cooking it, okay? So I'm just gonna do this again, cut it some more. Uh, the first thing I cooked, wow, hmm. I don't remember, I think it was noodles. So I'm gonna cut some um, tomatoes. I actually told the guy at the market, I don't like tomatoes that soft. I hate it. I like my tomatoes like really hard. So yeah, I cooked um, noodles I made, like regular noodles. Uh, for, okay, I think my mom started us off with like frying eggs, <laughs> boiling water, <laughs> and, then, and then rice. Yeah, with some rice. Uh, Sunday rice and stew. Yeah. So I think this will do. Yeah. Let me tell you guys a secret. I don't like cooking for too many people. I don't like cooking in large quantities. I like cooking in, you know, small, but like for four people, that kind of thing. Cooking in really large quantities scares me, you know. So, because I came from a very small family. So. We're just five of us. So, well, my mom used to cook up a storm. Yeah, I can't tell you the other secrets because I'm not going to share all my secrets today. So I'm going to cut this off. So yeah, I love garlic. I'm going to be using just a little because I have a taster and I, you know, I, have, I always have to put them into consideration. I don't have to just say, okay, this is how I like something. Not everybody likes everything. I think this would do. Thank goodness I have a very big chopping board. For this pepper, I'm gonna not use my hands because, <laughs> no. I'm not about to go blind. So I'm gonna use a fork, yeah. I'm gonna assist myself with the, the fork, yeah? It's a very fine one. Oh, do you know, I just realized that the onion didn't um, sting my eyes. Ah, uh, it's my lucky day. That's why that guy is my guy. All those wicked people that will sell, sell you uh, onions that will be making you cry. So I need to take this down a little bit more. I'm also happy with the, you know, the innovation that goes on in the kitchen. Um, you know, like with all your um, blenders and food processors, those things make cooking so so much easier. One day I'll cook um, a fada sauce for you guys. I like cooking that because it's like look up. But today on Budget Chef, <laughs> it's all about egg sauce spaghetti. Sounds too shabby. I hope you cook it after. Okay. So all this is ready. Um, I'm almost tempted to put one more, but no, I think this is fine. So I'm just gonna add the garlic, okay? You know, I, you know I mentioned earlier that I love garlic, so I'm gonna add that. Yeah, so I'm about to, you know, um, cut this off. You know what I realized? You know, recently everyone is talking about like the whole Fit Fam situation. You know, everyone is very conscious of, um, you know, what goes on in their tummy, you know, everyone is cutting down the carbs and going more with protein and all that stuff. I like that. But you see, me, I like food. And I believe that when you want to eat food, eat it right. If I want to eat healthy, I know I'm eating healthy. But don't come and, and change my, for example, my okra soup, the way my mother, the way I grew up, you know, or egusi, you know how egusi is. With that oil dancing inside, all those, you know, you know those things. And then you now change it to healthy egusi. I don't like that. I prefer to eat with my everything. I mean, I cut down on oils and stuff. Okay, guys, so I'm done cutting my tomatoes, pepper, onion, and um, garlic. So I have I'm put some water on the fire for the spaghetti, which is already boiling. So I'm going to put my spaghetti in and... Um, boil it. So um, some people don't like the spaghetti, they like it whole, but I, the way I was taught though, I break it in, in small parts. I know it defeats the purpose, but that's how I like it. All in. Yay! And I'm going to put some salt. Alright, so just a little bit of salt in there. 
and I'm gonna put a little oil so that the spaghetti doesn't clog together. Just a little oil. And I'll quickly use this to, to rub it. Yeah? So the spaghetti doesn't clog together. And I'm gonna let it boil for about three or four minutes because I don't like my spaghetti so much. Here's a trick. You never cover your spaghetti fully. There's a lot of starch in there. So you can just cover it just like that and set it to boil. All right, so that's it. All right, let me get my eggs ready as well for the sauce. So I'm gonna use yeah, about four. It's so weird, I wash my eggs. <laughs> I don't know if you do, but I, I wash my eggs because I don't wanna say anything nasty, but I wash my eggs. <laughs> I wash it. So I'm gonna break it into this bowl. So I'm very careful when I'm breaking eggs because I don't like to see shell in my egg. I hate that. Totally hate that. And I try to open it carefully because you don't know whether the egg has gone off. Well, they said you can you can put it in uh, water if it floats and all that stuff. But yeah, my eggs are clear. I'm not gonna put anything in it because I don't want it too spicy. So it's gonna be plain. So I just knead it. Why I don't wanna put anything is because I'm gonna make a sauce and I'm gonna spice it and all that. So it's not too much. My spaghetti is getting soft. It's looking good. Well, let me just leave it on for like just a little bit more. And we're almost set to cook. Yay! Okay. Um, I'm about, this is the most exciting part. You know, I'm so dramatic. This is like the most exciting part of this show. I'm about to cook. Oh, so I need to put on my apron. Like, yeah. So cute. Ankara so bad. You have to keep it Nigerian, keep it fresh. <laughs> okay, so my apron is ready. Now, let me give you guys a trick that my friend, my good friend, uh, Jua told me. If you want to check if your spaghetti is cooked, all right? I've, I've actually taken it out of the fire, I've strained it, I've taken out the water as well. Uh, you want to check if it's ready. All you need to do is just take one and smack it on the wall like that. <laughs> if it falls, it's not cooked. Stuck on the wall. And you know it's cooked. Capish? Yeah. Capish. Okay, so let's throw that away. So it's time to cook it. So I'm going to um I'm gonna use a wok. Yeah. So I'm using the wok because, you know, Japanese wok, because when you use it, the food cooks all around, you know, because you get the opportunity to like, you know, stare and everything. That's why people, every time you are rushing, you're eating Chinese food, Japanese food, because, you know, it, it allows it to cook um, everywhere. So it's not like in the pots, that's all, it's not like it doesn't cook in the pots, but, you know, you just have the option of, you know, using all corners of the, of your pot or wok. Yeah, it's the wok. Okay. <laughs> okay, so yeah. We're about to start, so I'm gonna put some oil in my wok. I'm one of those people that, you know, we cook old school way. There's no measurements. That's how my mom taught me. Just enough, I've looked at the spaghetti. Yeah, that should do. Because we needed um, tomatoes and pepper to really cook. So I need that, and of course, this is gonna bring out some water as well. So I'm gonna take my tray. Please don't fall. All right. So when the oil comes up a bit, I'm gonna put um, my onion and my garlic for just like maybe 10 seconds or so, you know, to steam, to fry into the oil. Hmm. So I'm just gonna wait for it to get a little hot. I don't want it too hot so it doesn't get burnt as well. Yeah, so it's getting hot. So I'm gonna put in. I don't know what it is with um, garlic and... Everywhere smells so good. Can you smell it? Oh, I bet you can. Okay. 
So let's let that go in for a little bit. And yeah. Being an OAP is, is a lot of fun. It's, it's a lot of work as well because you have to do a lot of research. A lot of people take your word for it, you know. Um, you have to be, you have to read, you know, you have to know what is going on around you. you should, so let's say, for example, you go to um, an oil company event or something, you should have a bit of knowledge about what goes on in an oil company. You should be able to hold conversations. Uh, people say it's a lot of fun because we make a lot of noise on the, you know, on the radio. We are shouting, we're screaming, we're dancing. It is, of course, uh, you get to meet loads of celebrities and all that stuff. Um, but you also <laughs> work your off, you know. You have to be very engaging. People must not know that you have problems. You don't have to bring your problems to work. Put a bit of black uh, pepper in here as well. Spicing is good, but not too much. Sorry, like I said, the way I grow up, everything is with your eye, using measuring. Um, okay, I could put a little bit of thyme leaf. But yeah, being an OEP is, is, is fun. It's, it's exciting. It's demanding, especially the days, this is curry, especially the days that you're not having, like, you're not feeling too good or you don't feel like, you know, talking to people or whatever. But you have to come up and, you know, do your job. I like music, so I like my job. Wow. This is the most delicious spaghetti egg sauce you've had in your life. So um, my, my sauce is frying now. Um, you know they said the trick to know if your sauce is ready is when you see the oil settle on top. So we're almost at that stage. And when that happens, I'm going to put in the eggs and fry it a little bit before I turn in uh, the spaghetti. I've tasted it. it. It tastes pretty good. But I have a taste. I remember I mentioned my friend Jua who told me the secret of when you're making spaghetti, you throw it on the wall. She's going to be my official taste. She's going to taste my meal and tell me how great a cook I am. So, yeah. So this is even almost ready. All right, so um, this is hot, and I'm gonna put my eggs inside, guys. My egg is going in. I, I tell yeah. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> darling. Hey. This is how you're cooking today. I'm actually surprised. You've never invited me over to come and eat. Wow, <laughs> you are. You know I've made some food, and I've asked you to come over. Okay, yes, I am. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm no, guilty. No, this is the first time. Okay, I'm guilty, I'm this guilty. Is the first time. So you will definitely try my food. And it better be time. good. Yay. <laughs> so this so is, what are we cooking anyway? I'm making spaghetti egg sauce, all right? Okay. And I even shared your trick. You remember that trick you told me about oh, when we make pasta spaghetti? trick? Yes, the pasta trick, and it worked. Did it stick? Girl, it's so cool. Imagine it's in the other stick. Oh, God. <laughs> My career would just be finished. Okay. So I'm almost done, and okay. you're going to be, you're going to, you're going to try it, right? Can't so wait. I'm actually starving. starving. Thank you. You're starving. You're starving today. This is how you dress to cook in your kitchen. <laughs> Uh, you know me now. I like to keep it well. Actually, it's for it's for camera. Yes, that's for, yeah, you know that the camera is right those, on those well. small shots. No, 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 I don't want to do that. Why are you lying? It's rapper that you tell when no, you No, please, I don't tie rapper. <laughs> I don't tie. Listen, like, don't mind her. She actually ties her rapper to cook. That's not true. I don't even know what she is that. What is her rapper? What is that? Yeah, she said if the kitchen is hot, I should sweat. <laughs> And then she'll send a picture. I'll send you guys the picture. Guys, it's a lie. <laughs> it's almost ready. It looks really good, Joe. I hope it tastes <laughs> as good as it looks. Don't dance yet. You know me, I'm a tough critic. Guys, Joe is one of the most <laughs> brutally honest people I've met in my life. That's not true. I'm and very that's why nice. I like her. I'm very, very nice. It looks, it tastes just as good as it looks. Don't oh, okay. listen. It's nice. Okay. So it's almost so ready. So do you need me to help you? Should I help people in the pasta? Yes, you can help me. So let me make myself useful here. <sighs> More. Yeah, that's that's how my mom also she says you can't put everything in until like we are sure that everything is in. I think us Africans because we're not used to measuring. I and didn't measure the, throughout this process. We so. cook with our eyes, <laughs> <laughs> and um, I, I prefer it that way because it's about do you, do you your measure when you're cooking. No, I don't mm. because it's all about taste, look, and feel for me. So mm. I use my eyes. So. You think, I think this is good. Yeah, that's but okay. I, but I don't want it to be too soggy as well, so I'm gonna have to. And do you want? 
You look like you want to stand in I know, I'm like... <laughs> don't, 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 don't. This is my show. Do <laughs> you know that I use 400 naira to cook this? I think even... You're yeah. joking. I'm telling you. In this in this island area. Are you serious? Yeah. Actually, so, please, well, you have to tell me where you are today. And it you actually know. really looks good. 400 naira. This can last me for like two or three days, so... Right <laughs> yeah, because I'm sure you don't eat that much. Yeah. So, yeah. Good, uh, Judy, is it okay? I think so. I think we're ready. To, I'm starving. Please, I've turn off this thing. Let's Wait see. now. Is it ready? It's ready. It's ready. Are you not one cooking? Why can't you give me this ready? I'm just like, is it ready to go? <laughs> it's ready to I go. I don't hear. Don't yap me. <laughs> okay. Turn it off. Okay. I'm hungry. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you. So, yay! Yay! I can't believe you actually spent only 400 now. Yeah, I did. So, I'm going to put this off. <sighs> see me itching to hold. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. The spaghetti egg pasta is ready. So I'm going to plate it and have Jua taste it. 150,000%. So the food is ready and I'm about to plate it right now. All right, let me just take this excess uh, egg from Please, here. I like my food plated as if I'm in a five-star restaurant eating gourmet food. You know, the way they swirl the spaghetti and have like a middle thing and, you know. I'm just yeah, saying, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know how to do it. You know, I just, I just got back with friends. I know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, sir. I just got back, yeah? You know what I I'm mean? Joking. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's, she's taking the piss. So, um, yeah, unfortunately, you know, I use 400 hours for this thing. So, all that there, I cannot follow, you know. So, no problem. So, put that in. Like, a lot of food, so. No, 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 the pasta is okay, but I like more of the eggs and all those <laughs> You're such a grub. Right, so I put that for you. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, I think I should brush for myself as well. She might even taste this food the whole time. I'm not really, I'm not really a taster. That is something I actually can't do. I find it so hard. Because the problem is that when I finish eating, you'll be so up, filled up, right? Because I finish eating chicken, I taste that chicken, I taste that. No, but if I was cooking meat and all that, girl, I would have. Okay, so um, let me give you a nice, pretty cutlery. Yeah, this looks like you're very pretty. Thank so, you. Taste it. Moments of truth. Drum roll, please. please. <laughs> okay. So you ready for this? Yes. Yeah. You ready? Five, four, three, two, one. I love it actually. I can't believe you only spent 100 hours. Yeah? Is oh it, my is god, it? I think I'm actually gonna need more. Do you guys eat? You need to try to get it. Nice and soft. Mm. The egg is good. Mm. Spicy, right? Mm. Pepper, okay? Mm. Yeah. You know the thing with spaghetti, people like loads of pepper in it. Mm -hmm. But I'm also I love like, pepper as well. Yeah. I, and even with the eggs, like you can eat this without even putting meat or fish. Yeah. Because yeah. of the egg. True. The egg is actually enough. It's just incredible. I have never spent 400 hours in my life. Love it. Yay! Yay! This is the first time she's eating my food, so yeah. So, so if you were to rate it, honestly, what, what, what? This is perfect for you. It's how you'd have cooked it. It's how I would have cooked it. Definitely. I would have maybe put a bit more pepper. Pepper. Yeah. Pepper. Yeah. But apart from that, perfect. Yay! But well, my that? restaurant standards are quite high. I know. I know now. You know what we're going to eat. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> but out of ten, I would definitely give. You Considering the fact that she spent only 400 naira to cook this food, mm -hmm. it's very tasty, it's mm -hmm. refreshing, mm -hmm. it has like, it, you know, the bits and bobs inside the spaghetti that you can actually eat. The egg is nice, it's not overpowering, it just complements the spaghetti. Wow. Like yeah. Because <laughs> I'm a foodie, that's why she actually invited me. Yeah, it's true. But it's, it's, it's really nice. I would definitely give her 9 over 10. Yay! Because I don't just want to give her pepper. Awesome. <laughs> Perfect. But nice. Thank, Thank you, you, Caleb, for having me. This yeah. is really nice. Yeah. So when next are we having this Very soon. lunch or dinner? Yeah. yeah, so I'm going to make you something special. Maybe Banga next time. Banga next time. Our favorite. Yeah. Yeah. That's our favorite food. Yes. Today. Okay, cool. cool. All right. So since you did a very, very good job, I've been asked to actually give you a present. So, yes. Really? Yes, yes. Whatever I didn't like the food, you are not going to get this present, by the way. Thank goodness. This so, present, so where is it? All right, then, let me get it for you. So, it's a chef hat and an apron. Oh, Congratulations, Kayla. I have You've never... You've done a fantastic job. <laughs> Yay! Wow, well, thank you. Can I wear it? Can I wear it? I'm not sure going to fit. Yeah, I think it's big. Okay, we'll just keep it like that. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, Chef Taylor. Ooh, and I like, I like the color. It. I do. It's yeah. like denim. It's like denim. So stylish. That's why it's yeah. stylish. The yeah. stylish Kayla cook. I'm going to put this over my... Yay! So for cooking an amazing meal, this is what I got. So I am the best chef here. Ah! <laughs> Thank you, babe. You're welcome. Thanks for having me. You're welcome. All right, darling. All right, guys. I had an amazing time on Budget Chef. I'm going to tell you something. I would never have thought that 400 naira can make a meal so delicious, like my friend said. I love, 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 love my, my gift. I think it's really cute. I'm going to use it you know, whenever I want to cook. And um, you could try it at home. You know, it's recession time now. 400 naira, you cook a proper meal. And look at that, able to serve um, a couple, yeah, I think about three more people can have this. So keep watching the show. I had a good time with you. I hope you had a good time with me. Bye.